guys, I'm back in Malaysia, back in Kuala Lumpur, and all I can say is that it feels so good to be back. Kuala Lumpur now feels like my home from home, and waking up to this view every single day never gets old. gonna be doing, seeing and eating everything that I missed whilst being away from Kuala Lumpur. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it's like a Chinese. Oh, it is. Like um, a. I forgot what they're called. So this cafe is called Raft, and it is one of my favorite cafes in KL. They do such good food, and the coffee is amazing. It's kind of hard to find, so I'll put a link to it in the description box below. But I'm ready to eat. I'm so hungry. The jet lag is real. If you see the dark, dark eyes, blame the jet lag. So I'm running on caffeine today. Charlie's gone for something he always goes for, which no, is. I've never had this before. Yes, you have. You have it every single time. Oh, the classic eggs Benedict. Have you missed it? I have indeed. <laughs> the best egg Benedict in KL. Best. Fact. 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 No fat. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yum. Mushrooms. Thank you. I thought I wanted breakfast, but it's actually like half past three in the afternoon. As I said, I'm jet lagged, so I have gone for a Caesar salad with the side of mushrooms because we get them vegetables in. Who doesn't love the chicken Caesar salad? The best Western breakfast lunch food in Kyle. Right? Back. Raft Cafe is where it's at. How are you feeling about being back in KL? Great. Yeah? The heat. The best city in the world. The best city in the world, y'all. <laughs> no, I feel good. Yeah? Back yeah, to routine. Back to routine. Feeling motivated. Got the momentum going again. This is our year, baby. Woo -hoo, let's get it. Let's get it. <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> Bam. <laughs> and you win some prizes at the end so let's go do the class I definitely needed that. So this was a 45 minute energizer flow. This is Hot Yo Studio and I've been coming here for like a few months but it's really, really good. And you can pay monthly per class, you can get a free trial. So I definitely recommend to come check out this Hot Yo Studio. It's one of the best ones in KLCC. One of the only ones in actual KLCC area as well. So Hot Yo Studio, I'll put a link below. <sighs> I'm feeling the jet lag right now and it got fast real quick, but I wanna show you the view outside of our apartment window because I believe that if you ever come to KL for the first time, you must stay in an apartment which has this view. So I forgot to say, we're staying at the Tropicana residence, which is literally the building here, which is right next to the Petronas Twin Towers here. And I would highly recommend you to stay here. It is a little bit more expensive, but it is worth every penny having the view. And we pay about 6,000 ringgit per month to stay here. Like I said, it's kind of expensive, but if you have the budget, I'd highly recommend it. And I think per night, £100 per night. Let's eat. So 
So this restaurant's called Pampers, and every weekend they've got a live band playing, if you couldn't hear already. We've been here a few times, and the steaks are amazing. Usually I'd go for a steak, and the steaks here are amazing, aren't they? Fantastic. Oh, <laughs> How have you had it cooked? Uh, medium rare. Ooh. Of course. But this time I've decided to go for a lamb shank with mashed potatoes, some lovely rosemary sauce, and some mixed vegetables. That is so tender. Oh, tender lamb shank. It's just unbelievable. It's almost like sweet as well. How was yours? That was great. Wow, great. It was great. You know that food's good when Charlie says it's great and not okay. It's just a basic steak. I feel like you should be a food vlogger because you... Really good art. If you say it's great, it means it's really, really good. <laughs> yeah. I am absolutely parched. Does anybody else ever come out for food with their partner and just sit there the whole time eating? not saying anything because you're enjoying the food so much. <laughs> we don't talk when we have food together. That meal for us both was 350-ish ringgit, which is actually very good considering it was a steak. I'm not gonna lie, I could definitely go to bed, but I'm trying to keep myself awake so that I have a proper night's sleep. So there's only one place left to go that's gonna keep me awake. So we're walking down the good old infamous Chanka. If you want to see more of the nightlife in KL, this is where it happens. And I made a video on this whole strip of bars. You can go watch that video next. I'll put a link to that in the description. But so many things have changed already. We've only been gone for two weeks, but it's actually a lot different. There's like a Romney Burger stall. There's some like new clubs and bars. We're doing dry January. So we're going to skip Chanka for tonight. Thank you. This so you is where everybody asks you if you want a massage. And all the girls ask Charlie if he wants a massage. <laughs> do you want one? I do. Do you want to get your feet rubbed by Only a, if I've got three, I'll a lovely... The <laughs> no, thank you. So guys, if you're single, this is the place to come. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> Of course, the first day back in KL cannot be complete without a quick visit to the famous Jelana Law, the street of food. Oh my God, we love it here. If you've never been, there's so many restaurants, Chinese, Vietnamese, Thai, Malaysian, all sorts. And then there's also like street food as well. And a lot of durian. Charlie loves durian, love don't durian, you? Yeah. Love my the smell of it. <laughs> There's one specific restaurant that we always go to when we come here because the food is so good. Menki Grill Fish. It's got the blue tables and chairs. So I just want to show you because that's one of the restaurants that I would highly recommend to go to try the food because it's honestly delicious. Haven't tried loads of them on here, but that's my favorite because it's just good. So stick to what you know. That's what he always told me. What? Stick to what you know. But you still don't listen. <laughs> to come to Jelana Law and not eat anything but I am just too full and there's nothing really at all there is mango sticky rice there that looks good well I'm just yeah I'm just being greedy um, but I wanted to show you in case you haven't seen it one of the best places in KL if you ask me I hope you've enjoyed this video if you did enjoy this one I think you should watch this one next and subscribe to see more bye bye <laughs> Woo!